Morning everybody, I'm the Yorkshire Fossil Hunter, welcome back. Uh, we've come down to Hilston today, well actually Tunstall, but we're walking nor north towards uh, Hilston. Uh, we've been going for a couple of hours now, but I've only just decided to get my camera out. I've had a couple of fans already, so I'll show you them soon. It's a beautiful day, I'm out with John and Chris today. Plenty of stuff on the beach to look at. Plenty of interesting shapes and sizes. So I'll get looking and I'll get back to you when I find some of it. It's a great big pin of valve there. It's a bit missing so I won't be taking that. But it's always nice to see. loads of metal washed up here so I'll be keeping my eyes peeled for another one of them silver coins now it doesn't look like much but they're quite unusual to get these preserved as good as that I can't remember what they're called but I'm going to take that I'm going to stick it back together and I'm going to wear a braid it and I think that'll be quite a rare find I'm happy with that. Happy days. I've oh, something really nice here. It's, I mean, it's going to be a pig to prep. If I can get it out, that is. I don't know if you can see that in there. But it's a beautiful reverse of an ammonite. So I'm going to see if I can get the rest of that nodule out. Be ashamed to leave it, even though it's in the cliff. The tide will just wash it away. Let's see if we can get it out. Let's see if it's out inside. So I don't know if you can work it out, but I've managed to get one out and it's an absolute beauty. We think it's an Amalfius, uh, but a really rare one. So I'm happy with that. Patience and keeping an eye on the cliffs pays off. I've got a couple of cutters here that I've picked up along the way. I've seen Chris cut and polish stuff like this and it looks really nice. I've got a, a block with loads of calcite in it. So again, cut in half and polish, that'll be nice. Just come across this fragment. Great big fragment again. There's a bit of calcite in there, so hopefully that'll look nice. Happy days. Couple of fragments together, full of calcite. Not sure about that one, but we'll take it anyway. You never know. And then I also just found this little nodule, really little, and inside there's just a little nut, which is always good. Happy days. Right, it's one of them shells, one of them blocks what potentially has got uh, pleuroceruses in, but this one, where is it? I think it's right there, you can't, you might not be able to make it out, but I think there's a Amaceris or something like that in there. Only really small, but nice, so I'll take that. There's a few things coming out the cliffs today, which is always good. Just come across this. I don't know if it's a large fragment, but it's it's a multi-block. There's loads of ammonites all in there, so that'll prep really nice. Happy days. Know when I've got something good when I'm smiling, I've got a vertebrae. I always want to find stuff like this, and 
nine times out, well most of the time, I never do. It's quite worn, but there's still a bit of shape there. Uh, probably an ichthyosaur vertebrae, which is a marine reptile. Absolutely brilliant. You can still see the uh, the, the dints where the neural arches are. I, I believe where that was connected. But yeah, absolutely buzzing with that. Brilliant find. A little bit tidy enough to do. Probably won't even do that. Happy days. Now the wind's really picking up now, so I hope you can hear me. Uh, we're heading back. We've walked absolutely miles today, uh, so we're heading back towards Tunstall, but. Um, uh, south of Tunstall there's always chance of a few decent rock fields so we'll go have a look there as well but up, for, up to now this is it there's no major rock fields but the tide is, is right out now so we'll have a good look on the way back hopefully we'll get some more decent fans absolutely beautiful today on the Alderness coast I love to see the mist rolling in like that We've come across a, a bit of a boulder field now. There's a few uh, nodules getting hit, nothing in them, but I've got a few fragments, stuff like that. Plenty of fragments on the Alderness Coast recently. A nice little multi block there. And then I think I've got one more. Oh. I've got another multi block there. That might actually be the, the matrix to one. Another fragment. That'd have been lovely, whatever that would have been. But yeah, looks very interesting. Hopefully, we'll get something really good. Just in case we're going nice and slow. Cold. I think I'm going to put my jumper back on. Just found a, a likely looking nodule and I've given it an it. And we have got some lovely little Elis, Elegantisaurus. Loads of pyrite kicking around here, so it's always a good sign. Across a really big multi block. I mean, it's really pyrotic, and there do seem to be all on the outside, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. There is some on the inside as well, and it looks like there's a bit of wood there. I've got to take that. I've got to. Woohoo! Happy days, John and Chris, chipping away, we're all getting a few good finds today so that's always good. Got another great find, a nice looking nodule there, give it a nick, and inside there's an absolutely amazing ammonite. It's a nerdy one so I mean it could be a, some sort of perinocerous or something but want to prep and get ID properly. Bag's getting heavy now. And we've still got ages to go. So I think I've had a really good find. And I mean a really good find. I don't know if you can work it out. I will try and take some stills and put it on when I get home. But I think there's a couple of ribs in there. There's an ammonite right in my thumb. There's potentially vertebrae there and then the best bit about this by far is I mean I could be wrong here sorry for the wild camera but I'm excited you see that 
that could be a tooth and if it is i swear to god i'm just gonna absolutely love it <laughs> so yeah whoop whoop happy days what a great day it's been today i'm just gonna find room in my bag for it now no gain the things we do here for a bunch of rocks so thanks for watching i hope you've liked it uh, don't forget to like and subscribe it really helps my channel grow uh, and i will try and put some stills up shortly so you can see a better view of what i found today thanks very much